all new tonight at 530 new information and a story we first brought you as breaking news last night at five. The Kings Mountain man accused of brutally killing his girlfriend's two year old boy faced a judge for the first time this morning. He's 21 year old Taylor Peeler. This morning a judge denied his bond after police say he killed two year old Rymel Collins. NBC Charlotte's Ashley Daly has been following this heartbreaking story for us. She's live at the Cleveland County home where this incident happened. Ashley. Yeah, Sarah, a family of two year old Ryan Mel Collins referred to him as Diggy for short. And here at the home where police say the incident happened, you could see his family has hung this t shirt reading RIP Diggy. Never easy. Never easy. Kings Mountain Chief of Police Lisa Proctor has been in law enforcement for 28 years and says crimes against children are never easy. If we don't stand in the gap to help protect these children and to help investigate these cases to the best of our ability, who will? That's what we're called to do, and that's what my officers and I do. And that's what her officers did around 5 Sunday morning when a call came in from the Kings Mountain Hospital. They say two-year-old Rymel Collins was brought in with life-threatening injuries. Upon initial speaking with the staff out there, it was determined that we needed to contact investigation unit to conduct a full investigation of the injuries involving the child. Police say Collins passed away from his injuries Monday and on Tuesday arrested 21 year old Taylor Peeler, charging him with his murder. That was a two year old child and, and even though two years sounds like a short amount of time, it's a lot of love within those two years and that's just really sad to me. Sahira Patterson didn't know you? Collins but lives do? nearby. Now she played in the yard with her one year old son Wednesday, couldn't help but Big think dream. there was a Big lesson dream. for Shut all up. parents to take away from this tragedy. Um, I'm, I'm sad this happened. Hopefully parents will take, you know, take it more serious who they allow to be around their kids when they're not there because you never you never really know somebody fully. Kings Mountain Police tells me although they've made an arrest, they say this investigation is still ongoing. And I've also reached out to Diggy's family, his father today telling me he declines comment because he doesn't want to risk jeopardizing this investigation. Reporting live in Kings Mountain, Ashley Daly, NBC Charlotte. Ashley, thank you.